Hey guys, Dan here. Uh, back with episode, I think this is episode 9 of Regraft Challenge. So, uh, once we left off, let's stop, left, wow, yep, I can talk, easy. When we last left off, uh, got some redstone, that should be here, somewhere, right there. Got an ender pearl, got some stone going, uh, or done I guess, and a bit of mining, which got that ender pearl, not the ender pearl. The fighting guy, the Edinburgh. Mine got the red snow. I'm smart. Alright, so let's do a bit more mining here. Right to. And. Come on. Uh. Actually, no. I'm gonna make a computer. Actually, I need this. And. One of these and one of these. Okay. Might as well make a um uh modem. Uh wireless modem as well. She takes one of those. Okay, so computer it's like so. And wireless modem. Like so. And where shall I put these? I guess. I don't know. I wanted a decent spot. Maybe I'll mine out a bit in the wall right here for it once he comes back up. But for now, I'm just going to place them down right here. And set as label, label set console. <clears throat> Alright. So, we will uh, do a bit of programming with that later. And, uh, yeah, I just need to look at something really quick. Okay. Um, so, yeah, we'll do some programming with that in a bit. Um, and that should be fun. It won't really come in handy until get another wireless modem for the turtle, but we can start working on it, I guess. Regardless, anyway. Um, so, yes. Let me see here. What to do? What time is it here? Let's see. Okay. Once it's night time, I'm gonna go back out and look for look around for some Endermen. But until then, I don't know. Let's see. Uh, ooh. let me just uh, one second. Okay, I'm back. Uh, so something just popped up on my. Anyway, um, so, I guess I will go ahead and just do this programming right now, f for now. So, do I want it on that side? So, to, yeah, whatever. Doesn't matter, it's only one little thing that I need to change. Okay, so, let's do edit console. This is going to be the main script that it is going to be running. So, well, basically the only script. Um, so what we're going to do is, uh, open the modem, which is this, and it's on the left side, which I'm pretty sure it's perspective of which way it's facing, so it's going to be like this, so that's the left side of it, obviously, so it's going to open up the, uh, rednet, whatever, the, whatever, you know, uh, and then, uh, actually, wait, what am I doing here, uh, Local, yeah, okay. Local bits. Wait, hold on, I need to look up the uh, API real quick. <clears throat> um, uh, where is it? Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Okay. 
I don't know where it is, but I'm pretty sure this is what I need to type. Which is local width height equals term dot... Oh, that's what I need to look up. It's a term, not local. Derp. Term dot get... Uh, get size, I'm sure. Choose two arguments containing x and y values. Same size of the screen. Local equals the term. Okay. Get 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 size and turn that clear because we're gonna clear the screen with that, um, basically. And then while true, while true do, which basically is just gonna be an infinite loop. Um, send message and dist. I'm going off of this kind of, um, I have to look back through this because, uh, I have to make sure that I'm doing it right. It's basically the, it's going to be, uh, the red net receive. So it's going to be. The first one is the sender ID, and then it's going to be the message, and then the distance that it is away. I don't really need the distance, but I will leave it there just in case it needs to be there. So, so send is the sender ID, which is going to be whatever the turtle ID is, which is probably three, maybe four. And then, uh, actually, no, it's going to be one, isn't it? Uh, or zero. I'm actually not sure. I'm not sure if it starts at 1 or it starts at 0. Probably 0. Uh, receive. And then... Scroll. 1. And then I'm going to set the, set, set the cursor position. Cursor pose. Which is what I want to set that one to. I'm typing out a lot here, but uh, some of this stuff's a little, little, uh, a little weird. Which uh, wait, set cursor pose. Set the current position on the screen. Okay. So, I think it's one height. So it does x, x and y, right? So it's going to be the height of it. So it probably goes down. I want it at the bottom scrolling up. So it'll go one. Oh, it's not even. Oh, there we go. One, two. Height. Wow, I can't spell. One to height. One end height, not one to height. But yeah. And then term dot write, which will write to the screen. Message. And that's basically it. Um, and once I have more... Uh, and I'm actually, there's a little bit more to that, but it's nighttime now, so I'm gonna go out looking for some Enderman. Enderman. I want you. Looking for some Enderman. Get out of here. Thank you for dying.
Alright, so never Enderman when I need to need the Wow. Really can't talk. I need Enderman. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, uh, I don't need spiders. No. Ow. Enderman. Oh, Enderman. Who look like? Who looks more like? Yay. Actually, I think it's just a little strange. Maybe it's just normal like but it's not like... I don't know. It's constant low frames for a reason. Why is it so loud also? Oh! Nope, that's not what I want. Crap. Okay. That was great. Now the world needs a loading again while I'm freaking recording. And now. Wow, the, the traveling herds there. Uh, herds packs. I just want Enderman. That's why the FPS. Freaking varying so much right now. Ow! Run away! Ow! What is going on? Are there too? Are there like too many monsters over there that it's just lagging my computer a little? That's sad. Alright. Thought that tree was an enderman for a second. Alright, how you doing, buddy? Oops. What's going on here? Oh. Oh, look, more redstone. Okay, so... Uh... Have fun. I need another sword, because this one's going to die soon. Oop, I don't even have any... Uh, uh do I not have any wood? Oh, there we go. Okay. What? Oh, okay. It's annoying. Um What am I doing? Oh my god. I'm so good at this game. There we go. Alright. Nope. Let's get back out there before it's daytime. Oh my god, stop lagging. I don't know why you love to lag so much right now. It's not even that bad. I mean, my my frames aren't going under 30, but I can notice. I can strongly notice when my frame rate is changing, because basically I'm I, I've set fraps to record at 30 frames per second, but um and usually to lock. Uh, it'll lock Minecraft usually in the 30 frames per second. But sometimes, like right now, it'll break out of that lock and go up to like 60. But Fraps will just try its hardest to keep it down at 30, it seems. It seems like my computer and Fraps are just fight. What just happened here? Anyway, it seems like my computer and Fraps are just like fighting to uh, control my frames, and it's really annoying. Because it's so noticeable to me that my frames are changing from 30 to... I think it goes up to like... Let me see if I can get it to change. 
Is there, oh, there we go. Goes up to. It just, yeah. Like every few seconds, it'll just go up to like fifty-four ish. Fifty-four ish. Oh no! Nope, this time it's going up to sixty. So it'll go up to about sixty, and then it'll drop back down. Right now, it's actually staying at sixty. But then if I go back over here, drops right back down to thirty. <clears throat> And it's very, very noticeable. And very, very annoying. So, yeah. When did I start this? Like, uh, 20 minutes ago? About. I'm trying to keep my episodes about 30, 30, uh, 30 minutes. I'm not doing too great on it. Because I'll notice when I get to about the 20 minute mark, and then once I hit the f uh, 50 minute mark, or not 50, like the 42-ish, 45-ish, I guess, minute mark, then I'll notice again, and I'll be like, oh, well, yeah, now I've recorded for 45 minutes. There. So yeah, it's also getting quite cold, so that's fun. If you didn't know, I live in Maine, and in, in, in Maine, we're having a long winter. It's still very cold. We just had a snow day last week, and by last week, I mean the week of, what was last week? The week of the 17th. We had a snow day on the, uh, uh, I think it was Wednesday, right? On the 20th? Of March. Ooh, more redstone. Wow. Yeah, a ton of that stuff. Okay. <clears throat> um, so yeah, so it's still really cold here. It's so annoying. I mean, we're still getting snow. A little bit. Not as much now, but... At least during the day, it's not too cold anymore, but... God... Why is a grass blocked here? It's an enderman put it there. But, uh, yeah. It's the end of March. It's March 30th. It, the, all the snow should be gone. We still have a bunch of it. If anybody wants some, come on up to Maine. It's stupid. It's too cold. I'm still using a space heater. Should be using a... Well, no. Because we shouldn't really be using a... AC yet, but N AC and air conditioner. Yeah, okay. <sighs> yeah, we shouldn't be using an air conditioner, but shouldn't be using a freaking space heater either. It's too cold. Let me see. Let me see if I can turn my uh oops, that's what I wanted. Once I Let's see if I can kind of figure out about what the temperature is right now. No, that's the one I wanted. Come on, there you go, buddy. Change over to here. No, this doesn't really give me a good uh, representation of what the actual temperature is. I got a, uh, for any of you that actually know things about computers, um, which I'm not trying to imply anything that a lot of you don't, but, uh, you know, whatever. Uh, I got a new, um, fan controller a few days ago, and it has some, what do they call that, temperature probes on them, and I didn't really, I didn't really know what to do with them, so I just, uh, put them around my case, or, sort of, I mean, a lot of people will put them on, like, uh, their heat sink or whatever, I was just like, yeah, no, I don't, I don't really want to go into that, because, I mean, I don't know. I'm I'm uh I don't want to say clumsy, but like I I kind of just like do whatever. Um so I don't want to like just put it on there the wrong way, on my heatsink the the wrong way and like make it um a lot less efficient or like break it or whatever. So yeah. <laughs> so I shouldn't even put it on my heatsink. I put it 
uh, next to the fan of my heat sink though, so I kind of get a sort of a bit of a reading on that. But I don't really care about that because I have a program on my computer that can just summon the the uh, temperatures of my stuff. Um, I did, however, put one on. Uh, I have two sticks around on my computer, and I put one like on the stick on one of my sticks of RAM in the middle. If you know what I'm talking about, like, um, on the inside. So it's, it's basically the temperature probe is sandwiched between two RAM sticks, and it's actually on the uh, the heat spreader of the uh, RAM, and it's currently. 36 Celsius, degrees Celsius. That's the only one that I really cared enough to actually put on anything, because I, um... Oh, rain, no. My, uh, no, I'm not even gonna deal with rain. Screw that. Does this work? Yeah, very good. I'm not even gonna deal with rain. I hate rain. It's really annoying. It's way too loud. Especially for recordings, because it just, I feel like it just completely overpowers my voice. So, I'm not even doing it. Um, but anyway, what was I saying? Oh, right. So, uh, so, what was I saying? I don't even know. Um, yeah. I have no idea what I was saying. Oh, right. So, I don't think the uh, program that I have on my computer that tells me the temperatures of some of my stuff um, tells me what the temperature of my uh, my RAM is. So that was the only one that I cared enough to put it put it on. And uh, truthfully, I don't really look at it all that much. Usually, I just have the display off. But uh, anyway, so most of the other ones uh, are just strewn about. Actually. One of them was on my hard drives. Hard drive, actually. In my hard drive cage. Um, I think it's on one of my hard drives. But I can't remember. can't remember if it actually is or which one. So, so yeah. Uh, but the rest of them, I have one just kind of sitting on the uh, plastic shielding of... Uh, my GPU, I've one, let me think, I have one on my RAM, wait, I have five total, I have one on my RAM, one of on my hard drives, one of on my CPU heatsink fan, uh, one on my GPU shielding, and... Where's the last one? Oh, and one on the top of my PSU. Which isn't... I didn't put it there to get the actual temperature of my PSU because it, it's it's not in a place to be able to get any sort of reading from, from my PSU. It's more of um, trying to get uh, sort of like an ambient temperature of my case um, towards the bottom of it, basically. So, yeah, which is current, wait, which one is that? Is that going to be five, I think? One is on my RAM, two is on my hard drive, three CPU, four GPU, five PSU. So, my fifth one is currently t 20 degrees Celsius, which is, well, like 60-something Fahrenheit, 68 Fahrenheit. So, the ambient ish temperature of my case is about 68 Fahrenheit 20 Celsius which usually is a little kind of warm but I mean my fans are only on like really low but whatever um so yeah because one of my fans gets really quite loud whenever it uh whenever it's on well it I don't know, it's not that loud. I think just the speeding up of it is kind of loud. Once it's actually sped up, then it's decently quiet. But it's really bright. It's a red LED one. That's really bright. I'm going to stop talking about computers now. For anybody that I'm just completely boring.
the uh, the minds out of those people that don't know what I'm talking about, or don't care about what I'm talking about, or both. So yeah. So back to the uh, main point. It's cold. I don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> Still use a space heater in March, in the end of March, even into what's the next month? April. <laughs> I almost checked my calendar for that. I'll have to use it in April, mid April, probably because that's how stupid it is. So, we have a break night time, so uh, some endermen will spawn. It's all I'm trying to get right now is some Enderman. Then I can do a big change to my programs. Come on, Enderman. You know you want me to stick my sword in you and kill you. It's not meant as a sexual innuendo. Unless you want it to be. I just want Enderman. Come on. Not skeletons. Enderman. 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 Oh, come on. I don't think I'm ever going to get any Enderman. This is dumb. Nope. Really? 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 Nope. Done. No Enderman. None in sight. Why are the chunks loading so slow? It's weird. Hello. Alrighty then. Okay, go ahead and do some more mining. How long has this been going on for? When did I start? Yeah. I think it's been going on for. Uh, 30, 30, 30 minutes. Alright, I'm just gonna go through this night. Maybe less. Enderman! Get over here! want to stand over there because of the freaking noise. It's not even a mad at me. Why was the noise playing? Now it's mad at me. I hear the noise. Ah, ah, ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah. That was horrible. No. Just, uh, let me kill you, please. Ah! Why do they have to have terrifying noises? Why? Please. Uh. Oh god, I dropped it. Didn't even drop a freaking pearl. I'm 
coming for you. Oh boy, I'm coming for you. Ah! Alright, run away. We're getting- Oh no! Get some health back. Stupid enderman. Where are you? Are you kidding me? <sighs> Stupid. I don't like this game. Two endermen in a row not giving me one... Freaking pearl. Should have just broken the rules earlier and gotten that one. I was stuck in the last episode. God. I'm mad right now. Just need one ender pearl. Just one. Yeah, shut up, pig. I don't even make fun of me. I don't care. You're just a pig. I mean, come on. Freaking skeletons are harder to kill now. And Endermen have all these stupid, creepy noises. And they teleport away before I can even hit them. I think that's the stupidest thing of all, though. That even, like, the second I swing, before I, it even, like, registers, before I even actually hit them, they just teleport away. So they don't even get any damage. They just teleport away, and yeah. Oh, and that one earlier. I think probably also in the last episode. That I almost had killed, and then it was daytime and just teleported away. And didn't come back. Well, I'm about done. About daytime now. Just looking around. Oh, watch. I'll get this one so close to dying, and then it'll just teleport away. Or it'll kill me. One of the two. Or not dropping an pearl. Come on! Three in a row not dropping any pearls? That's stupid. About to punch a little baby cow. I'll do it. What's the drop rate on them? Like, is it just like, oh, what the heck? What is that? Oh, that's my other uh, thingies from my other house. That is just not coming in, is it? <laughs> all right. Well, oh, all right. There we go. I think I do that like just about every time. I just fall. All right, let's throw this stuff in here. Okay. So, um, how do I make a monitor? That's another thing that I'm going to want to do as well. Monitor. Oh, monitor. Oh, that's easy. 
Okay, so let's make some monitors. Ow. Just hurt my foot. That's great. Shit. Just. Oh my god. That's so annoying. Ugh. Okay. Uh, oops. Okay, take those, you take those. Have fun. Okay. Um, so yeah, basically I'm just gonna put, uh, how many monitors do I really need? I need... Um, let's see here. Actually, let me just see this code real quick. Uh, uh, it's not turtle. It's red, uh, what is it? Rednet? Rednet dot open. Now, is that going to be right or left? Let's see. Right. Yeah, okay. So, rednet dot close. <clears throat> so, yeah, so I'm gonna, I don't really want to leave this here, though. I want to put it in here. So I think I'm going to do the uh, console right here, and then one, two, four, so eight monitors here, because I want them to be wide. So, let's go ahead and grab this guy. And... And then, um, I wonder if this will work. No? Okay. Worth a try, I guess. Uh, okay. Hmm. Uh, da 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 Dig forward. Shit, I wonder if I can OS load OS dot load API T expected string T dot forward. Sweet. Okay, so I think we'll go there and then one, two, three, four. And T dot up. Time to call nil. That's weird. I'll have to look at that. Turtle dot up. Turn right. Alrighty then. Actually, let's look at that. Exit and edit T. Uh, so it was on line 38, I believe. 
while not turtle up turtle up do I have no idea what's wrong with that. Oh. Attack. Well, Vlad hasn't uh, encountered anything where it needed to go up in the mining. That would have been really bad. Really bad. Pretty sure I set the label for that. Oops, I should have put done this also. So, uh, and T up for forward. 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 OS load API. Should have just done it the old fashioned way. Put it in a lot quicker. All right. So you put that there. Put that there. Uh, I think I know how to do it. <sighs> Come on. I can't do it the way that I like to do it anymore. The way that I know how to do it. <laughs> I mean, this is a lot easier, but I have, like, in muscle memory how to do it already. How to, uh... Um, alright, so, that monitor isn't actually done yet, obviously, but to incorporate the monitor right under the red net open thing, I'll put it local, because it needs to get the width height there, so I'll need to incorporate the monitor here. So local monitor equals peripheral wrap. Uh, right, and term dot redirect monitor. I think that's it. Oh no, monitor. Got to scale the thing. Uh, is it monitor scale or monitor? Go look. Monitor. That's a modem. Monitor is not in the API listings. What? What the heck? Monitor. Um. Oh, monitor set text scale. That's what it is. Set text scale, and I can't remember, so I'll just do one. Whatever. Uh, I think that's it for incorporating the monitor. We'll save and exit that, and also the monitor isn't actually completed yet, so let's get that done. Oops. Okay. And then console, no modem on the left side. What? Eh, oh. This is on the right side. Right. Which makes the monitor on the left side. Left. And actually for right now, I'm just gonna do this. Uh, t 
term dot set or term dot scroll one term dot set cursor pose. I'm not sure if this will work. I think it will. Height because I've never done it this way before, but and turn out right. Receive, at least we're receiving. Receiving, no, that's not receiving. I don't know if that'll work, but whatever. Console receiving console. Turn on now. Uh, what's going on? Edit console. Uh, what line is it on? Thirteen. No, oh, spell receive way wrong. Receiving, yay! All right, so basically this is the monitor, and uh. This way, turtle out. What the heck? See our mining trip? No. Where's my tur? Oh, he's in my inventory. Derp. Okay. <laughs> I named him Turtle One. Okay. Uh, all right. Well, this has been going on for. <sighs> wow. I didn't see that happen too. It's been going on for like 30, 40, like forty-five minutes or so. <laughs> Please die. Thank you. Just a quick check. See if there's any endermen. If there are, I will attempt to kill them. Just gonna do a quick check because uh, this has been going on for about 45 minutes ish. Uh, and it needs to be done. <laughs> it's also 3 in the morning. So, almost three in the morning. All right. No one in sight. And I'm not gonna go around looking for him too much because I do want to get off. It is three in the morning. I need to go to bed. I'm kind of tired. So, uh, yep. Let me just put some stuff in the chest. Do do do. All right. There we go. So next time, hopefully, I can get another Ender Pearl decently quickly, and we can get this whole thing right up and going. Um, that's gonna be a lot of editing with the mining script. Um, to do the sending of stuff, which will be basically sending um any refuels it does to this uh. Any ores that it finds, any, uh, I don't know, whenever it starts a mining run, whenever it's done with a mining run, it'll send a message over here, and, uh, oh, sorry if you just heard that, uh, that's oh, making a lot of noise, hopefully that wasn't wicked loud, probably wasn't, I'll just make it quiet in, uh, editing, anyway, so, uh, so yeah, once we get that other wireless modem up and, uh, made and on the turtle, we'll do a lot of editing to the mining script. But until then, I will see you guys next time.